that uh, the, the, the genocidal language that's been used in the press, the Maoists must be wiped out, they are pests, you know, this kind of thing. So I really went in, because th there's no news that comes out of that forest except a whole lot of lies. You know, so I thought, let me go in and, and find out what's going on. And I went in with my own prejudices about Maoists, about the fact that women are naturally going to be victims in an armed you know, in armed struggle, and found, to my amazement, the opposite, that there were 45 to 50 percent of the armed cadre are women, and a lot of the reason they've joined is to escape the patriarchy of their own societies, you know, and uh, these are, I mean, there's, there's, a, uh, there's a, an organization called the Krantikari Adivasi Mahila Sangatan, which is the Revolutionary Indigenous Women's Association in English. It has 90,000 members. Technically, they're all Maoists. Is the government going to wipe them all out, wipe them all out, as they say? Because in that area where I travel, there's a river called the Indravati. Across the river is what the, the police call Pakistan. And the, the superintendent of police actually told me that, uh, ma'am, across the river, we shoot to kill. So they are, they are shooting to kill, mm. you know, and um, so, this is what is going on.